Hello guys, welcome back to an episode of Minecraft Let's Play. And as promised from the last episode, I I actually wait, wait, wait. I actually finished whatever we did there. I like covered the roof and all that. And yeah, now we're left with the second part of building the thing. As you can see I got a bit of excess smooth stone. I'm completely out of tinted glass. And yeah, we're gonna be building the trap doors and stuff. And if you, you guys are wondering, uh, did I chose this spot arbitrarily? Did I just like randomly put it behind my house because the nether fortress happened to be there? Say nah, actually, the distance away from my house is actually just, just enough. I mean, the spawning sphere here, there you go. As you can see, the sphere that's green is actually the area around me that's too close to me for mobs to spawn. And so mobs don't spawn there? Hold up. But the red sphere on the outside is actually far enough away from me that mobs will spawn. And it's, and if you take a closer look, God damn it, the creeper farm is actually right smack within that red area. And yeah, it's actually all calculated, guys. You just didn't know. You just didn't know that was a thing. Okay, took a while to break. Right, we need some trapdoors. Okay, this one here. I calculated the amount of trapdoors that I needed. Because we need a lot. We, we need like a few stacks of it. Wait, let me sh look at my calculator real quick. Okay, we need... Uh, uh, what, what's that? What is this? We need 8 stacks of trapdoors and a stack and a few of buttons. And to prepare myself for that, I've actually chopped down a lot of trees while waiting for this episode. So you guys realize right here, a lot of the lands here is laid out, and that paves the way for me to do terraforming in the future, on stream probably. And I'll remove all of these, all of that, it'll probably be one big flat land right here. And that would allow me to build more things, and maybe make a line to the villager breeder right there. And yeah, stay tuned for that on stream or like <laughs> if you guys watch the stream, do drop by the stream if you guys you, know, you guys eating or you know grabbing a snack, you have nothing to do, just drop by the stream. And yeah, as a result of it, we got we got a decent amount of where's my sticks at? Sticks saplings. I'm probably just gonna bone mill all of it, turn them to bone mill. And apples of course. So yeah, let's let us Start, shall we? We need eight stacks of trapdoors, and we got some birch too. But I don't know what we use the birch for. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be so bad, bro. Okay, trapdoors. Got two stacks and button. Can't pick it up. What's going on here? It's another four. Oh my. Do I have enough wood? Do I? Did I miscalculate this? Miscalculated place? 2, 4, 6, and all and one more. Do I have just enough? Bruh, I'm stuck. I'm literally crafting so many pieces of trapdoors that Minecraft can't even register. Alright, 2, 4, 6, 8. Nice. I didn't even need these. Okay, and some buttons. I need a stack in it. Oh god. I guess in a half. I didn't really calculate how much I need. Okay, it's a better way to do this, isn't it? Screw it. Let's just go with it. That should be enough. That should be enough, I think. Okay, now let me guide you guys on how to set this up. I changed the water stream slightly too. Like, instead of like, going down all the way to that side, I should make, I made it go to the central point in the middle, so the, the 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 blocks won't go too deep. Let's hope nothing spawns here. Alright, that's great, that's great. I have to struggle through this. Get out there. Oh shit, it's two blocks. Wait, never mind. I can I can do this, I can do this. There you go. Oh my goodness, this place is wrong. Oh okay, thank god I got one spare trap door. Alright. So that's, that's what you're gonna... Bruh... Really now? Really now? I have to go grab this trap though. 
Alright. Alright, let's, let's do let's let's do what we do. Let's not go up on this side this time. Go on the first one. I'll make that same mistake. How oh, this works? No it doesn't. What if I do this and I break it? Okay, I didn't get it either. Alright, so you have to place it at the bottom here and flip it up. So what the mobs will see is that Oh look, there's a block here and when they walk past that block Sight, it ain't a full block, so they just fall down. Okay, that's how the favorite farm works. And you can, because you place the trapdoor, you can sort of walk through it, get without worrying about dying, you know, fall inside that same hole. Hey, there you go. So yeah, we just have to keep doing this. And then I'll lay out the buttons later. This shouldn't take too long. This episode should, shouldn't be too long, I hope. I hope. That's all I can say. Oh my goodness. Better not place this wrong. I have any extra trap doors on me. There you go. Yeah, this should be pretty simple to do all, all around. Oh my. I just don't place them wrong. I do not want to have to go back down there to get all the trap doors that I misplaced. And aside from these trap doors, you also have to put trap doors on the top of these blocks. And with that, only creepers and spiders can spawn. But if you want to prevent, prevent spider spawns, you can use the button thing that I'm about to do later. Because spiders need a 1x2 block to spawn. That means they need 1 block high and like, not really two blocks, but yeah, they need like two blocks for for to spawn. So if you put a button in, they can't spawn. Or um, they can't spawn as often. Alright, time to go to the other side. For which I'll just use a dirt block for the traverse. Bruh, I collected that dirt block, of course. Of course the dirt block, but not the trap doors, right? Okay, as you as you may have thought, this is the step that consumes the least Bruh, the least trapdoors. You can actually do this. Open you, climb top of you. Get here. There you go. This this step consumes the least trapdoors. The one that actually consumes the trapdoors are the ones on top. I was like, bruh, it takes up so much. And you may have realized I put torches in here too. Because mobs do spawn in here. This is a mob spawner. But. Putting the trapdoors on top is a, makes it a creeper and spider only spawner And putting the buttons makes it a creeper only spawner So yeah You don't even need to run over the trapdoors, you can just casually walk over it Because it's hard for you to drop through that Oh my goodness Climb yeah, be, be, be expected to go through there a lot. Accidentally placing the trapdoors in the wrong place. It's for sure, this is the most boring part of the build. I mean, honestly, if you ain't having fun with your builds, then it's probably too grindy. But we'll see. I'll be, I'll be attempting to make a lot of large builds in the future. But I, I kind of need a good time lapse software, that's a thing. I don't know if I can like make a um, Java slash bedrock server. In that case I can get a friend or, or two to get in the server and record me. While it, I, while, while, while I do my, my shenanigans. And Java is way better too for making time lapses and all that. Like please Microsoft. Please. Like you know you just need to get some user support here, you know? Should I get the trap loader down there? Why not? There you go. Yeah, once you've done with that, now you have to put trapdoors on the ceiling. How fun. Right, that out of the way. For the ceiling ones, I don't really have a. I just put blocks in here just in case I fall down. 
I didn't say that you generally want the trapdoor to face the same way on both directions. Slide down one here and one on that side. Just so it makes the farm more consistent. I mean, it's better that way, isn't it? There you go. Alright, now I can't possibly drop down, right? Can I? Who knows? Okay, now for the trapdoors. I can still walk through this, there you go. You just have to do this all around. Obviously, you have to avoid the one in the middle. You don't even put the one that has water on it. Because why would you? There's one more in it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this one, you don't really need to follow any patterns. Because the box, the mobs ain't even a walk off it. Shit, pounds actually, but never mind. Should be it, there you go. Ah, uh, guys, do I do I want to destroy this? Not yet, not yet. All right, I'll show you guys how to place the buttons too. So you would, like you would want to start from a corner. You go two blocks in front and one block across, and you place one button here. And you go two blocks in front, one block across. Place a button here. Two blocks in front, one block across. A button here, and that's it. That's the formation that we have here. You can do the exact same thing here, but mirror it. Two blocks in front, one block across. Two blocks in front, one block across. Two blocks in front, one block across, and there you go. Now that you have this pattern, you can actually just extend it around. And maybe I should just do that. That's like the quickest thing that I could do right now. It's two blocks down and one block across, so it's here. And it should match up. If it doesn't match up, then oh my goodness me. I fell down, I fell down, I'm a mob, I'm a mob. Save me. Where will we? Alright, here. Here you will. There you go, bruh. Matched up. You all didn't see that. Here. Just be quick about it. Just be quick about it. Don't think about it. Two blocks across. Uh, two blocks down, one block across. This block here. And there. Easy, isn't it, guys? Now it's a creeper only spawner. Granted, I do the same thing on this side. Hold up. I hope I have enough buttons, I don't have to go back home just to get more buttons. Two blocks down, one block across, so it should be here. Right there, there, don't miss the timing. Stick to the beats, stick to the beats. So next one should be there. And last one should be at the corner. Wait a second. Wait a single second. Did I place that wrongly? Or did I place that wrongly? Huh, wait, let me just... You know what? First of all, but across, let's put it there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah that's right, that's right. Because it's the corner, isn't it? Not mind, not mind guys, I just, I just had a... Realization moment. Oh, there you go, three extra buttons. Close enough for that. Estimation. Pretty good estimation. Alright, now with that, the first row is done. And with that, I shall destroy these torches. And hope for the best. Can I grab the torches? There you go. Now there's trap doors here. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Another 8 here. 2, 3. That's done. Drop in the water. No, guys, please do not drop in the water. Break this. Break the torches. And as you can see, as we go, we'll slowly break the torches and eventually we'll have creepers in. Wait. Yeah, yeah okay. Let, let's just do that. Creepers can't do shit because it's because they're in the water. Like, what can they? What can they make explode, bro? Five, six, seven. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Walk across, break this. Do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, 
that row is done. This is pretty quick now, isn't it? It's pretty quick now, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now on this side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we're going quick now. We're going quick. We're going God mode, bro. We're going God mode, bro. Let's try this. Come on. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, wait. I'm going to block across. Delete this. Get that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Another row here. Two, not there. Not there, please. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just enough, bro. And I hope no creepers start spawning. Not yet, at least. That way, here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And so this video is just gonna be me counting. I mean, I can count silently too. Just more entertaining content, isn't it? I'm hearing a grown ass man count because he can't count. Two, not there, not there. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Across, make this, make this, and this, and this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, Guys, and the last one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope. Seven and eight. And there we go, guys. We are done. We are done with this. Let's get out of here, bro. Oh, shit, start spawn. Alright, now that we've done with it, creeper should start spawning now. But we need that chamber down there, so yeah, we'll do that next episode. Cause yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just the torches are kind of bothering me, but you know what? You know what? That's fine. That's just fine. My parrot over there. Where's my parrot over there? Where are you there? Oh, you you were you were following me, weren't you? Huh. Yeah, let's just take a look here. Should eventually see creepers starting to spawn. I don't know. Do you guys see anything? Because I don't. But yeah, it definitely works, guys. Just need to trust me on this. Just need to trust me on this, right? So right here, down here, it's going to be the so-called cell where the creepers drop into. And yeah. It's gonna be made of glass and it's gonna be the same as a villager breeder. We're gonna get a piece of water here and like drive them into a corner, get the minecart and drive them to wherever they need to be to be charged. And then they go straight into the kill chamber. And yeah, that's it guys. That's it guys. Ooh, everything is fully grown. Huh. Haven't harvested in a long time, haven't I? Let's let's just do that real quick, alright? Deposit our extras. Extra this. We don't need any more scaffolding. Extra buttons. Uh, torches. Can I leave them here? Yeah, why not? Torches. 
dirt, book goes back here, bowl goes back here, crafting table, the whole one. Start harvesting, shall we? I don't worry about no, no what yet. Let's get a shuriken, to be honest. Very nice. We literally have been just chopping trees and focusing on the farm. We haven't even the creeper farm more like. We haven't even seen that the shuriken is fully grown, like three blocks tall. Give me that noise shell. There you go, very nice. Thank you for your patronage. And now we can make our first conduit. Very, very nice. Stack and seven shuriken. Uh, conduit. Mark drop. Very nice. There you go. And that concludes the episode guys. If you love this episode, please do drop a like and maybe drop a subscribe as well and hit the notification bell. It helps us a ton. And then honestly, it's free and if you don't like it, you can always unsubscribe again another day. And yeah guys, that's it. That's it for this episode. See you guys in the next episode.